What's up, you guys? Marty Schwartz here with Marty Music, hanging out in uh, Nashville with Raylan Baxter. What's up, dude? Howdy, man. Man, so so nice to see you. We're here in this rehearsal space. Oh, yeah. You getting ready for touring? Uh, yeah. Bi- well, some big shows coming up. Big show. They're all big shows. Yeah. They're... Yeah. We're rehearsing songs that we 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 recorded a couple years ago that have not been played yet really uh we did rehearse all week last week with four of us drum bass guitar and me and then now we got our friend nathan on the keys and our friend josh another guitar and some you know front of house production stuff microphones and we play in nashville uh tomorrow night but you know there's records but the live show is like it's modern you know it's like yeah it's 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 the now it's i don't place the songs from 12 10 years ago the same I try to though, but I think some of the best music was never played the same way to it twice. How long have you dedicated yourself to like doing music? Like how long have you Let's since see that, since that decision? Fifteen years ago when I moved here. Okay. Yeah, I was um, living in Breckenridge as a, I was a snowboard instructor. I did I read your Wikipedia. Bro, I fucking <laughs> like got frostbite in my fingers and nose and had to hitchhike into work. Uh, but I did play open mic night at the Gold Pan Saloon every Wednesday night. With Sublime and. Um, Tom Petty and the band and Jimi Hendrix and Hell Old yeah. Crow Medicine Show. And the first night there was 15 people there and then I, I got there at the beginning of November and moved out the end of February. But by the end of February, we had a whole party going on. Hell and so, yeah. so my dad came and picked me up. He's like, I gotta go back to Nashville to work. You wanna come with me? And I said, yes, please. You named or mentioned your dad. That was Bucky Baxter, right? Pedal Steel was like his claim to fame, would you say? Yeah, he was one of the best. Yeah, did he teach you music? He he did. Like in the ways of in the ways of like, he'd see me play C or, or he'd see me play G like that. Yeah. He'd be like, man, you don't want to play G like that. You want to play G like this. Yeah. Um, he'd see me play F like and hit these strings and be like, yeah, yeah. No, throw man. your thumb over, man. Yeah, yeah. And then lift stuff like that. Yeah. So the more he pointed out when I was listening to music, when it was firing on all cylinders, when the drummer was playing a beat that the bass player wasn't playing, but each each buddy each person had a very important role in, um, you know, getting to that 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 special place. Then did you immediately want to write songs and become like an artist, or did you just want to play? I didn't you mentioned like Sublime and like maybe like the stuff you were listening to as a teenager, probably. No, I I played lacrosse. I didn't. I didn't play music till I was 22. I okay. didn't start. I got, I got a guitar. Similar to me. I started playing guitar when I was 22. I played covers. You know? Yeah. I just played like. And so um, you could just naturally sing, I imagine. I didn't know this, but yeah, I could. <laughs> I mean, I was. I could sing as a kid. Yeah. But I wasn't. A, I wasn't singing. It was like you church. You were thinking about it. Yeah. Yeah. Which is the best. Yeah. Do you remember like the first like classic riff that you learned just like as a beginner? You were older, but yeah. 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 That was it. Went camping with my dad. I was just going to say, that sounds like... The second riff. Nah, you can't go wrong with that. That was it. Those are the two. Do you mind, like, playing one of your tunes? Or playing part of it? Do you you want me to sing? If... Only if you want to. Yeah. Yeah, I would love it. Two of my friends, they're under the couch. Or do you want them to play it with you? They're going to come They could play it with you. Yeah. They know it, right? You guys down there? (laughs) And I want to train Chuck. Standing by the river, watching my bridge run down. 
I was standing by the river Watching my bridge burn down Well, I done a bad thing And I'm paying for it all right now I done a bad thing
and I'm paying for them all. Now. Oh, so nice to have uh, you guys jamming. We got Josh Martin here. Yeah. <laughs> and one more time. Uh, Barney Cortez. Barney Cortez, yeah. <laughs> so uh, you guys are going to be ripping it up at the uh, Brooklyn Bowl, yeah? And nothing's more, uh, nothing's more authentic than the, bro the one string broken uh, slide playing, right? Right. So you've got brand new album. Ten song. Ten song album. So let's uh, make sure that there's links below. You know, everywhere music is experienced, they can experience a new album. Just want to thank you again and all of you guys uh, for the fun, for the fun jams. Posse. Mm -hmm. 